Hello guys welcome to celebrity news and lifestyle where we give you the right update and all of what you will like to know concerning our music stars and movie superstars, so if you're new here or if at all you're just passing by for the first time, please take some minutes of your time to subscribe, like, comment and hit the notification button so that you don't miss in any of my uploads. She was extremely hurt Serena Williams ex-coach reveals how the American legends dealt. Is losing a match that bad? Marataglu, the chief strategist behind Serena Williams' win and the driving force behind rising stars like Stefanos Tsitsipas, thinks so too. Patrick Marataglu is a game changer, and he recently spoke about a very interesting topic. As an experienced coach, Marataglu shared some of his thoughts on his Instagram page. Without hesitation, Patrick Marataglu offers advice from Serena Williams' experience and is also inspired by Pete Sampras' journey. His statements about these feelings and how to deal with failure are worth discussing. The emotional ups and downs that follow a defeat are often underestimated, but Marataglu stresses the profound impact they have on players' psyches. Marataglu agrees that losing is a permanent part of the game. And frankly, looking at the visceral reactions of tennis greats like Sampras, Serena Williams and even a young star like Tsitsipas after a loss. It even gives a glimpse into the raw emotions behind the scenes. We all know that over the years, most players have lost more than they have won Patrick Marataglu said. But the loss doesn't matter. This is just a drop in the ocean during their career. His words reflect the seriousness of the issue. He added. I know someone like Pete Sampras who was in bed for two weeks after a loss. It has been destroyed. Watch Sampras' stance and Williams' reaction. As he put it. With Serena, for example, when she loses a match, she gets really hurt. This is a good thing. It means that she cares a lot. Marataglu reveals an important aspect of the failure. According to him, pain comes from sincere concern and stimulates the will to overcome failure. Marataglu continued his story and emphasized the mental problems that Tsitsipas suffered from after his heavy defeat in the Australian Open in 2001. Stefanos Tsitsipas, he's in the semi-finals. He lost to Rafael Nadal, and I saw him at 8 o'clock the next morning, and he was devastated. The profound injuries these players have suffered will accelerate the progress, Marataglu stressed. Beyond the tennis court, Patrick Marataglu's influence extends to the digital world through his insightful Instagram comments. Recognizing the need for guidance beyond physical training, Marataglu's initiative to share his wisdom on social media is a testament to his commitment. Through a series of engaging articles, he not only offers technical tips and tricks, but also delves into the intricacies of mental toughness. This worthy endeavor goes beyond traditional coaching, bridging the gap for tennis enthusiasts looking for guidance. Thanks for watching till the end, we are always here to keep you updated anytime you want to know more about your favorite celebrities, sports and movies superstars, and if there's something about this video that you like to share, please do share with us. And guys don't forget to subscribe, like this video, share and leave your comment on the comment section below your comments, matters see you next.